Welcome to In the Grove. Happy New Year, everyone. I'm Diane Malinowski, and I'll be your host today. And today we have with us Austin Guerrero from the Pavilion Fitness Center. Welcome, Austin. Thanks, Diane. Um, Austin is the membership manager at Pavilion Fitness, so tell us what you do over there. Yeah, so I oversee all the membership processes, beginning with signing up members for either new memberships or renewals. Uh, it also encompasses some of the corporate memberships that we are trying to develop here at the Pavilion. And then also with some of the cancellations that may be going on or anything in between from front desk supervision help to tours throughout the facilities. Well, that sounds exciting. Um, what are some of the uh, amenities you get at Pavilion Fitness as a member? Oh yeah, so the fitness membership, it encompasses a lot of the different abilities that we have at the Pavilion, starting with the second floor fitness center, obviously. Uh, you get the full usage of that, in addition to our Group X classes, which is also located on the second floor, and then going down to the first floor, you would have the ability of using the aquatic center located in the Pavilion. Oh, that's nice. So both of the indoor pools, and also the outdoor pool during the summertime, which is nice, you get to soak up some sun. And then you also get our racquetball court for free, and in addition to our pickleball courts. Right now we have uh, free pickleball going on, in addition to free basketball for our open gym hours. Wow, so January is a busy month for fitness in general. Oh yeah, it's one of our more uh, populated time frames, just because you have a lot of people really interested in getting back into fitness, starting off the new year strong, and the fitness center is the perfect place to start. And all we hear is new year, new you. Yes, new so, year, new you is the one being that we're always going with. Well, that's great. Um, can you join the fitness center if you're not a resident of Elk Grove? Oh, 100%. We are open to all walks of life. So whether you're a resident, you're a non-resident of the town, we 100% are available for you to check out the facilities. Um, you can also be a member of the village. We have a specific village membership that you can also encompass along with our corporate memberships and also the Elk Grove business memberships. We have a few of them just because we want to pertain to everybody that is a part of Elk Grove in addition to the non-residents. Do you go out and promote to businesses to come in? Yeah, so sometimes I'll be at expos, sometimes I'll be going through just two corporations specifically, either meeting with HR or corporate wellnesses, trying to develop our corporate plans with them. Um, Elk Grove is a very large community that encompasses a lot of businesses in the business district itself. Oh, yeah. So it's a perfect ability to start with and to grow upon, especially with the new year coming along and more people are always interested in fitness. So, so um, what's your big special for January? So January we have a no enrollment fee going on right now. Um, it'll be starting on the first of the year, which is awesome. We do have an enrollment fee throughout the rest of the year, but this time frame is a perfect ability to take um, charge of it. Typically our enrollment fees start at about $79, so you're walking in at a zero dollar amount to begin with. All you got to do is just cover the base fee for the membership and then you're ready to rock and roll. Wow, and with the full membership it's all the equipment, um, locker room, and then you have an indoor track, right? We do, yeah, so that is also a part of the membership as well. We do also have a separate membership for tracks specifically, and we also add a little bit more of an incentives to um, some of the seniors of the town to come and utilize that area. If you are over 65, we do provide a free membership to anybody that is an Elk Grove resident for the free walking track. Um, and then, like you had said, some of the machines that encompass the second floor, we did just get a six, we just got six more new machines on the fitness floor for cardio. So it's a perfect time to kind of come and check them out and see what they're about. Oh, it is, especially for longtime fitness members. They like to see the machines be updated and the new ones come in. Oh yeah, it's usually the first point of talking for them when they come on in, just they notice it immediately just from the color change and the environment change to begin with. And of course, everybody's trying to get on them really fast, so you kind of got to ask if you're still going, if you're going to be getting off soon, so it's a big amenity. And um, it's true that, like, if I were to come in in a new machine, a staff member would be there to, you know, show me anything that I, I mm -hmm. didn't understand. Oh, 100%. The front desk can always answer any of the questions that members may bring forward to them. We do have an orientation ability where maybe you're a brand new member or you're just not more familiarized with fitness in general and you just want a, an overview of what's going on, mm -hmm. you can always sign up for an orientation with us as well, but we always have hands on deck to, to go ahead and show members how to use machines or specific targeted muscles that machines are going for and things of that sort. Well, that's good to know. It's, and January is the perfect time to get out there. What I've heard and what I like is Besides a full membership, like you said, um, you can have uh, just go to the track, 
You can go to the pool. Mm -hmm. You can do uh, just exercise classes. Is totally. that right? Yep. We do have the separate membership ability right now. Um, currently, we have our fitness membership, like I had stated, it encompasses all of that, mm -hmm. but maybe you aren't interested in everything that that fitness membership provides to you. We do have the ability of signing up just specifically for maybe Group X classes, maybe you want just yoga classes, or you're interested in, like you said, just specifically the walking track, or even the Pavilion Aquatics, they also have their own separate membership. Oh, that, that's really nice. I know that um, the reputation of Pavilion Fitness is great with cleanliness, and friendliness yes. and then of course your updated machines mm -hmm. and all the things that you can choose from so yeah we're going around right now we're trying to get a little bit new um, not fully new environment but just to kind of bring a little bit of a new spark into the the atmosphere of it especially with the new year you want to go yes. into it with a positive standpoint but like you said we do greatly take care of our facility in regards to cleanliness making everything available to everybody or just making things more comfortable for for somebody at that point because we want you to feel like it is a community type of atmosphere that is what we bring forward but we have that really nice environment of a corporate style gym so yes you know, it, um, there's a lot of times someone in town will say i've never been in that building and it, it just amazes me because if anything, if you're driving past the pavilion, you should go in and have a look and come upstairs and see. It's a beautiful facility for um, this town to have to offer. Yes, I can tell you that I have been a part of other fitness facilities, specifically for park districts, as that is in the career that I do work for. And this is the best one that I've been a part of to begin with park district wise, in addition to fitness center wise. The abilities and amenities that the pavilion brings forward for just the membership in general is beyond better than what I've ever been encompassed to or brought into. So it's very nice to be able to start at a, a talking point with that for specific members or corporates. And then in addition, you have the ability of the facility where it's not just about the fitness center, it could be just about the pavilion and whole recreation is what we bring forward with the park district mm -hmm. and that's what we want people to go ahead and enjoy. So. That's great. Um, I have a copy of the Park District's winter brochure and everything about the fitness center is in here over several pages. Mm -hmm. And what's not in here is on the fitness website, which will be on the screen. So there's a lot of ways to find out if uh, you want to do your research before you go in. But I really do encourage everyone to go and have a look. Because once you're in there, um, everything is really nice. and. Again, the staff is pretty good. Yes, and if you're ever interested, if you haven't been into the facility or you're looking for just a tour, stop on upstairs. Like I said, the front desk can always help you out. I'm always available to go ahead and give you a tour as well. I can talk for a long time when we're on a tour just to give you a heads up because I am a very big talker. So if you're ever interested, come on by. we got a lot of friendly faces, and we would love to have you into the atmosphere. Um, so in January, the kickoff is zero enrollment for a full membership, but it's true, isn't it, that um, there's something almost every month, some type of special to let everyone try things? Correct, yeah. So right now, like Diane had said, we have that no enrollment coming on up in the beginning of January. We do try to offer a promo uh, almost every month or almost every other month, just because we want to entice people to continuously uh -huh. come on in. But we also want to provide morale for the members that are already a part of our current membership base. We don't ever want to forget them or leave them out. So that is something that we do try to do very frequently, especially with us working with one another between marketing and fitness. We do try to boost up that member morale very greatly with some of those offsetting memberships or offsetting promos. Well, that's really exciting. I hope that um, everyone does take the opportunity, if not in January, sometime in 2022. Yes. So we can have a new you in 2022. Oh, yeah. Come on down. And is there anything else that we've left off that you need to share with us? Um, uh, I think we've got... We've compassed pretty much a lot of what we're looking to do at the Pavilion mm -hmm. Fitness Center. Uh, we're looking to add in some changes, so if you haven't been into the facility before, keep an eye out for that. Or if you are a part of the fitness center, really be a part looking for that because you never know what we might be bringing in or changing with the facility, whether it's with the fitness floor or whether it's with one of the racquetball rooms or something in between. So, That's great. Yeah. Well, thank you for being here today and sharing with us one of the gems of the Elk Grove Park District and Elk Grove Village as a whole. Yeah. And we'll be right back. 24-7 pickup lockers are now available at the Elk Grove Village Public Library. 
Library patrons now have the option to select our outdoor lockers as a pickup location. It's perfect for when you can't pick up your holds during our business hours or you just don't have time to come inside. Patrons may place holds by logging into their library account via the library catalog, mobile app, or by calling the library or visiting in person. Held items remain in the lockers waiting for you for three days. Once you receive a notification that your items are ready for pickup, simply scan your library card or digital card on our mobile app or type in your library card number to the locker system. From there, enter your four-digit PIN and then press Log In. After you've entered your information, a locker door will open to release your hold. When the doors open, your items will automatically be checked out, so be sure to take all of your items. Press the Print Receipt button on the screen for your checkout receipt if needed. It's just that easy. When you're done with your items, just return them to the library's book drop. To get started using the new outdoor lockers, or if you just need more information, go to egvpl.org or call 847-439-0447. Thank you for watching In the Grove, and thanks to our guest Austin Guerrero from Pavilion Fitness. He gave us good reasons to start 2022 with health, wellness, and physical fitness. Check the website at pavilionfitness.com for all the latest updates. I'm Diane Malinowski, and I'll see you next time.